Ziggs! <laughs> this should not be allowed, chat. It should be illegal to do this. We look to the line mark. That's how you play the deck. I agree. Have I already tested Kale? Yeah, she, she's a very healthy vegetable, but other than that, she sucks. Is this the Acolyte deck? It is, yes. Correct. It's true, chat. Is that a challenge? I'm just being honest here. I'm just being honest. Kale is much better if CS and the Cultist Frostbite get nerfed. What's your country? Um, well, I was born in Yugoslavia. I was born specifically in Serbia, but I lived in multiple parts of Yugoslavia, so... Yeah. Him not attacking there is a misplay. Not attacking there is a pretty sizable misplay. Wow, what's he doing? What? I don't understand that. Why would you take the hit to face? I'm an aggro deck, bro. You're already down to 12 HP. The sea she calls, the world we answer. Let's do this and then let's kill it. This is one of his most important units. Even if it doesn't die, it's not a big deal. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, that's so bad for him. Why would you play it on that? Dude, that's so... His name is Papaya. Listen, it all makes sense now. His name is Papaya. Look at his name, chat. It all makes sense. I was confused. I'm no longer confused. That's how you spell Papaya in Serbian, actually. I'm not even kidding. This You pronounce J as a Y. As a y. Papaya. Papayaka. His name is Papayaka, chat. Nothing weird anymore. No weirdness here. Papayaka has spoken. Papa Yaka has spoken. I had a 15. It's kind of rough. Is this Acolyte Cancer? Yes, we didn't draw a single Acolyte. It's insane. Those who kill it. Wow, that's a good... That's a good, uh... Turn of events. I'm a fan of that. Wait. He just told me he has no combat tricks. That's so good for us. I don't think you guys realize how good that is for us. He can't afford to block this ever. Man is absolute fight. And I'll be level Zig, which is kind of nice. Ziggurthy is leveled. I don't think he kills us here. I mean, he can make a really thick Alawi, I guess. That is a possibility. Yes! I was literally thinking of that card. I didn't want to say it because every time I say a card, it literally doesn't get top decked. But I was thinking of a chat. I was literally thinking, there's no way I don't draw right of Arcane. There's no way I don't draw right of Arcane. There's, I, 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 it was going through my mind. That's what I'm talking about! Bootafo! Well. What you gonna do now, brother? What is your play now, brother? I demand to hear it. What is your play? So good at top decks, I bet you always know when you're gonna draw Merrick or Chavez. This man knows me. Absolutely. Alright, we won without drawing a single Acolyte. That's insane. And this deck has nine of them. You from Brazil? I live in Brazil. I'm living here. Born in Serbia. Grew up in s multiple parts of Yugoslavia. Kane Aatrox. Uh, I think I want to find early game landmarks. I'll keep the Acolyte though. Ooh, baby! We are gonna party today! Snap! Where's my snap button? Bro, I can't find it, chat. I can't find my snap button. It's missing. 
My snap button is missing. I can't find it. It is missing in action. This is such a good card against that. This is such a strong card. Holy crap. That's insane. I can block that, I guess. But I can't kill it. Let's let's go for this one instead. Like I'm not going to wait for this to be 5 HP. It's too long. I take too much damage. I would take like two more hits for that to be up to 9 HP. They're gonna outscale him pretty fast. Why is a flower elusive, anyways? It's stuck to the ground. <laughs> Good question. Okay. It outscales. Eventually it does. Oh, that's a nice draw as well. It's a very good draw. Terrible things lay inside. He can't block it, which is a problem for him. I mean, he could, theoretically, but I'm going to summon two more next turn. That's a lot of value. That is a lot of value. And it's only going to get worse for him. Oh my goodness. It's, it's, it only gets better for me as well. Holy crap. What's happening, chat? My board is too powerful. Too many Akulatas. Sheesh, indeed. Sheesh indeed, brother. We need to kill off his lifesteal. Obviously. Wow, he doesn't actually even buff. That seems like a bad play by, by him, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Hello, Kane, my old friend. Runus Acolyte's gonna ruin your day. They are far too powerful. <laughs> he, doesn't even have a, he doesn't even have a blocker, bro. Did we just open attack here or not? Bruh. Bruh. What is this? Oh my lord. Bruh! We got, a, we got two more coming down. <laughs> we, we gotta go for it. We have to go for it. It's too powerful. Yo, that top deck was insane, dude. That top deck was insane! Woo! Woo! Even more! Give me more power! That's a thick board, chat. That is Labordius Thickimus. That's what I like to call this board. Labordius Thickimus. Holy smokes. Any two kill him now. He has to block four of them. Hyanna, stop it! How will you stop it? Mm. Mm-hmm. 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 You still need another one on top of that. You still need a buff and block. And even then, you're down to seven. <laughs> it's all over for him. It was too much. <sighs> Imagine if he had Shang-Chi-La. Shang-Gri-La would have destroyed me there. It's true. That was unethical. I like the curve here. It's a very aggro curve versus a very, very defensive deck, so... Wow, that's a good draw. All right, that's basically, we just need to find these guys early on and we're good. If we're able to do that, we're very happy campers. It's such a strong engine when you find this landmark top deck. And he doesn't really have good blockers, because he's going to mana 4. He might ramp here now for a 2-2, two -two, but 2-2 two -two can't block us. So again, we have a lot of value coming down. It's fine. That's a very, very good new card, by the way. That card is actually insane how strong it is. Are just as good as big ones. The Nuts is top decking the landmark again. Do you think Flicker is a viable deck archetype in room tour with the current cards? What is Flicker? Sorry. That doesn't make sense to attack with, buddy. 
Thank you, Van X Peaches, for 28 months, man. Thank you very much, sir. I appreciate that a lot. Thanks, buddy. Oh, beautiful top deck. All right. Let's go. Because there's no deal three to everything. This is awesome. This is so strong. You can play him. But, uh, wow. Maybe that's a bit of a problem for me. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. I think we actually kill off Trundle this time. I think we have to kill Trundle here. Unfortunately, I think that's the plan. Uh, Trundle living is a problem. I could have pushed a bit more damage, but then Trundle gets regen. He can block every single turn. The uh, reason why this is good, because now we can play um, Ziggs Runes, Runes next turn. And yeah, him not having a blocker is very important. He doesn't have that many blockers he can play with. Mana 7 is fine. So, Ziggs is leveling very soon. Let's pop this. Just gotta watch out for Runation. Runation's a problem. 3 to 4... Prep. Okay. Feel the rushing coming. Maybe. Minus one cost. You could have Feel the Rush this turn. You're actually correct. But if you place Feel the Rush, I win the game, right? So we're fine. You lose if you place Feel the Rush. So you can't play this turn. It has to be a Vengeance. Recall, it's fine with me. This is actually not bad at all for us because now we're going to be popping all the landmarks with Ziggs. You'll see what I mean in a sec. No one play Will instead of Graph. We're pushing a lot of damage at the moment. So if he plays Field of Rush, we have blockers anyway, which is a good thing for us. He's down to 1 HP. Go ahead. What are you going to do now? Ruination? He has to ruinate. I mean, not ruination. Oh my, wait, what? He does not feel the Rush. That's GG, right? I think. I keep forgetting, chat. This deck is supposed to run Renation. Dang it. It's supposed to run it. It's not supposed to not run it. It doesn't make sense not to run Renation. <laughs> Alright, do your worst, brother. Let's see it. You don't want to pop this, by the way, I think. Um. Oh, he's down to one, bro. I have I have pokey sticks and stuff. I'm I'm good. I'm good here. Obviously, we can just get on um, it. So. Oh my god. Did we just win? Wait. Which one was Ziggs? This is Ziggs. No! How does he know? Stop it! Maybe he didn't drive the stairs. He might have not drawn it the stairs, chat. That might be what happened there. If I pass, he drops destroy my line marks. That doesn't work. What you do is you play a unit, he plays it that stairs. I play destroy Ziggs' landmark, which will, uh, actually, I don't even know if that works. No, it doesn't work. Never mind. It doesn't work. I was about to throw the game. Inventive Chemist. Yeah, I think in this deck, you just want to look for the landmark early. This one is just too strong. The fact that it turns itself into itself is just insane. This, uh, Reliquary is crazy. And if you draw two Reliquaries, it's almost, almost, always a good game, I feel. Brain did at least Noxus. I, I don't know if I've tried it. Have I tried it? I'm like, not this expansion. Previously, of course, but... It's such a strong um, engine. It's a very, very strong engine. I mean, 3 mana, 3-2 is nothing crazy, but... Still very good. No Mystic Shot? Okay. I'm not mad at that. Drop the Bomb is pretty good on 3 when he plays whatever he wants to play. Actually, Ziggs is really good, too. Who do I prefer? What do I prefer here? I kind of like to look for the landmark and just go crazy. Like, he's a burn deck. I just need to outburn him. I didn't draw it? Wait, what? Wait, how did I...
I think I need to get rid of this. I think this can outburn me. I think it can outburn me for sure. As a card. Will he play a unit? He wants to play another one of them if he has it. So he's just 2 out of 4, 3 out of 4, 4 to 4. Okay. Resolve. Uh, pass. We never pull this because we can kill it next turn to drop the bomb. There's the card we wanted to find. Nice. And Ziggs is leveled. Uh, of course I'm ready. This is really good. Um, we have a very good blocker for Boom for a rookie. We're not worried about it. Very annoying card, but okay. All right, we're just going to have to live with it. It is what it is. He's going to start burning. I'm going to outburn him for sure, I think. Because this leveled Ziggs. We just dropped Ziggs now. Uh, Ziggs with... The Unraveled Earth, I think, is the play. Yeah, we just play Unraveled Earth into Ziggs, I think. Unless we draw another one of these, then maybe we... Oh my god, what do we do here? We play Ziggs first, I think. Yeah, we play Ziggs first. We're taking a lot of damage to face. But so is he. Like, he's taking a massive amount of damage to face. Let's see, he plays three units and down to 12 HP. He's taking way more than that. These are all fearsomes and they're hitting for five each. I can do this. He actually. Yeah, he's in a lot of trouble here. Down to 2 HP, you can't let that happen. You have to block with this as well. He knows he has to block with this. Down to 2 means this literally kills you. It wasn't yeah. me. So I don't think he's doing enough damage here to survive. He knows just he can't be down to 2 HP with his level of Ziggs on board. It's just uh, impossible to win with. Now he might play a lot of like Fearsomes on the board, possibly. So unfortunately, he didn't go to 2 because I had Pokey Sticks out of the Wazoom. So this is very strong. This means every unit he plays, he loses. Wow, that's pretty sick as well. That's GG. If he plays any units, he just loses the game. Peace! <clears throat> Alright, good game. Hello, Raiders. What's up, buddy? I'm a simple man. I see Zig's deck. I like it. Sounds good to me. Victor Seraphine. Uh, wow, Rite of Passage is so strong with Acolyte Reliquary. It's actually insane how strong this is to have two of these on the board. Like, this is a broken combo. Only thing better than this is just to have two of these naturally. Like, that's the only way to make it better. That's nuts. Has a Kale Bard deck that isn't so bad. Interesting. A natural Acolyte top deck. And we actually have now... Oh my god, it's over. I want to snap. How do I snap, chat? How do I snap fast enough? Bro, it's insane. We have so much tempo. Dude, playing aggro is like easy. Like after playing Rise for like 30 games, playing this it just feels unfair. Like this... This should not be allowed, chat. It should be illegal to do this. Me play on curve, me hit face. Yeah, it's broken. And they're 3 HP already, bro. They are already 3 HP each. So he can't Mystic Shot them anymore. He could Thermo them if he wants. Too fun to be illegal, maybe. That does, that does, that does nothing. Brother man, that does nothing. I'm sorry to tell you. That one, one, nope. I'm fearsome. I strike fear in the heart of my enemies. Now we get to do Rite of Passage, unless we draw the one drop. Oh my god, it's so sick. It's so sick. What does this guy do again? Just create a random two-cost spell in hand on strike. I wonder if I let him do that. The future is not science. The future is acolytes, my friend. 
Acolytes are the future. My god, that's so broken. I probably do. I most certainly do. They can play Zig's next turn with uh, Unraveled Earth. That's so sick. They're each dealing six damage, bro. That's so sick. That's so disgusting. It's so disgusting. And they're five HP each now as well. What are you gonna do, vengeance my... <laughs> oh no! Are you gonna vengeance me? Oh my goodness! Maybe this can give you like invulnerable or something that doesn't exist in the game. Bro, this is so this is so silly. Face control turn five, it's over. It's sickening. Yes, it is. It absolutely is. And the best part is, even if he manages to deal with my board, I have unraveled Earth into Zig's next turn, just dealing damage to face no matter what. Vengeance the Nexus turn five. You gotta run, bro. You just gotta run away from this. Double Mystic Shuttle. Oh my God! Look at the Valu chat. Look at the Valu. Look at it. Look how much value we're getting. And I demand more! I don't know how he's gonna block two, two of them, because I'm already dealing lethal with, like, even with his current blockers, that's already lethal. Oh no! Why did this happen to me? <laughs> he's gonna revive it! I love it! I have made a mistake. Oh, okay, okay, that, that actually, that actually works pretty well. Never mind, never mind, I take it back. He actually had a good answer. I'm, I'm, he actually had a good answer. No, good for, good for him, good for him, good for him. I'm impressed. He had a good answer. Miss Lethal? How did I miss Lethal, chat? How did I miss Lethal? Explain. Explicarme, por favor. Can't even kill them? I think he will eventually be able to kill them. End his suffering? That can be a problem card. Her songs just make you feel like you can do anything. I don't want them to get pinged down. Um... Damn it, bro. What am I supposed to do now? I think I just go wide, honestly. I think we just go as wide as possible. I wanna, I'm gonna put these to 2 HP as fast as possible. He doesn't have mana for Ruination next turn. Jesus Christ. I mean, we just we just play more of them. I'm pretty sure I just play more of them. We don't open. Do we open attack? Because he can Mystic Shot, Mystic Shot, Vengeance Block, Mystic Shot, Mystic Shot. Ah, whatever, Chad. I'm just gonna attack. I'm just gonna attack, Chad. I don't care. I'm going all in. He can buff the block, Chad. There's ways to do it. He has stuns, maybe, uh, like five mana stun two units, Mystic Shot, Mystic Shot. Like there's ways to stop it. See. Listen, there, there's ways to stop this chat. There are ways. The five cost card can be stunned two units. I'm telling you. There are ways to do it. Safe? What did I tell you, chat? What did I tell you? What did I tell you, my friends? No, wait. There's, there's a better way to win. I could pokey stick, chat. Listen. I could pokey stick, but there's a better way. There's a better way to ruin his life. Ziggs! <laughs> oh no! Bro! Look at him! Wait, wait, wait! Go <laughs> So broken! Oh yeah! It's so good! Playing with Stop playing with your food! Why? I'm having too much fun! Playing my food is fun sometimes, chat! should play more with your food. All right, interesting deck. Gotta watch out for this one. Where's my landmark? Where's my one? Oh, baby, we found it. We found Acolyte's Reliquary. The only card this deck needs, literally. You get one of these, I don't even need any other cards. Just give me, just give me a deck with 20 Acolyte's Reliquaries. That's all I need. Anything else is over overkill. I told you guys when this card was shown, I was. What other streamer said this card is this card is going to be very good? I don't know. Maybe some other said it, but when this card was re revealed, I said this is a. Don't. 
stop it, Grappler. He's already dead. Stop! We got two? Bro. Bro. Oh my god, we even, we even have a way to kill Kindred already. It's fine with me. Brutal Steel is really strong here. Not that it really matters too much, but... Sunny said it sucked, but he's going to play it regardless for the memes. I said it was good. Because I said it was actually a playable deck archetype. Wow, he messed up. Because this buffs it plus one. That's, that's a misplay. Now you don't even kill it. It stays at one HP. Yikes, bro. And that's a yikes, my friend. Wait, he doesn't do anything? Wait, what? What's he doing? I like this attack. He has to play Kindred here. And I'm going to kill Kindred with this and laugh at his face. That's actually, that's actually fine as well. I have Rite of Arcane here. Perfect, 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 perfect curve! Out of my face! Now, I could have killed the wolf instead. I don't know what's better, killing the wolf or not. Um, unethical. Yes, sir. Very unethical. It's a great draw. Even if he kills one of them, I just generate so many more at this point. Double wolf is annoying. That's something I have a hard time dealing with. But he has to have what? Double... <laughs> It's already over. Oh my goodness. How have I not played against it? I don't know. I don't know. But let's just hit Diamond, man. At this rate, we're just not losing. Do I keep both Acolytes? I might actually just keep both here. If I don't find the Landmark, I need ways to generate their value. Okay, so we have three Acolytes. I just need Landmarks now. Okay, we have four Acolytes. This is, by the way, this is not the best Acolyte. There are better ones. Please don't hit a weapon. That's all I ask. He's going to hit a weapon almost guaranteed. But it is what it is. Reminds me of the Ice Worm. Oh my god, he didn't hit a weapon. That's huge. That is huge value, chat. That's a really, really good top deck. Because I can do that into this on Curve now. That's insanely good for us. I don't mind if he buffs this plus two attack. It's whatever. I, got it. I don't mind him blocking it. It's fine. This will outscale me. I mean, it, it's, it'll take so long to outscale that I, I think this is fine. The bigger the hunt, the I think that's fine. Th fine play to make. Attack with a two one. I did attack. Oh, oh my god, we found we found it. That's all we needed. This is all I needed. Honestly, that's it. That's it. That's, that's all we needed. We have to race this deck, in my opinion. I think we don't block this at all. That's a really bad play. That is a really bad play. Why would you do that? Why would you let me kill off one of your more important units? Like, that's an important unit. A piercing bolt. Yeah. It's fine, I think. I could have blocked with this guy, but I just want to go wide now. Give me the give me the landmark again, please. Um do, do this. Play Ruinous Acolyte here. I could also play Rite of Arcane if need be. To kill off uh, annoying units, but I don't know what's so annoying on like what he can't play Kane yet, for example. What am I truly annoyed by at this point? This is extremely strong. All things can be analyzed. Yeah, now we have to play because we need him to go above 3 HP. And they both kill this guy, so it's it's just... Valu. And the reason we didn't... Okay, that's that's very annoying. Uh, what do I do about that now? Do I just let it go through? Yeah, kind of sucks, but I have to pass. Naked Acolyte is fine. It could be. I'm gonna get the one drop landmark. Why I didn't get it? The child is gone. The killer. Well, now we have to play Naked Acolyte. I think. Be so much more. Serve 
be still. There's no value to be gained there. Aim for the heart. You can't attack with any of that. Um, <clears throat> do I take the hit? I think I think my loss condition right now is for him to level up Kane. I think that's how we lose this. I think him leveling Kane costs us the game. Because he can go elusive and then we can't beat it. Making them bigger is pretty important as well. I mean, eventually he'll block something. It's a very, very good trade. I'm a fan of this. Okay. Should play one more Acolyte? You think? It's a pretty good draw. Only war can bring me this. He can't really get value by attacking with him. That's a very good draw as well. May we bleed forever. Hush. There's no ping effects to worry about, are there? I don't want him leveling Kane. I think that's a loss condition for us, honestly. I truly think that's a loss condition. Let's put them above that threshold. And this is fearsome also. It's a pretty big fearsome board. Kill Aatrox? How? How could I have killed Aatrox here? Annoying. Extremely annoying. Well, this does kill Aatrox, which is good. Okay. So Aatrox is dead. That's important. He's up to 3 HP. I have no landmarks to play Ziggs with, though, which is a problem. I will take this power in my lady's name. I still have to develop him, though. I don't have a choice. This will be a blast. Ruination kind of sucks. Actually, I should have played around Ruination here. I think I misplayed. He could have mana for Ruination next turn. World Ender. Does World Ender beat me? I have a lot of HP. What Ruination? The 11 cost Ruination, what do you mean? Okay. Um, mm -hmm. He needs to put a weapon on this, basically. So I'm going to play Aqualite's Reliquary here. And then I'll pop it. Because he has to play a weapon on this. He will play a weapon on this for sure. Guaranteed. He's not going to play World Ender before he plays a weapon. Because all of these weapons are worth something. Right, now the question is, which one is the most problematic one? Elusive wins? How does Elusive one win? It doesn't keep Elusive chat. Elusive keeps Elusive? Come on, come on, come on. Are you sure? Wow. In that case, yeah, we have to do it. Okay, then, then yeah, then sure. Sure. I agree with you. If that's the case, I agree 100%. Let's we survive a trucks pretty easily, right? Burn mana? Why burn mana? Oh, yeah, I could have burned mana, but then I don't push two damage to face, guys. I disagree with that. No, I'm, I'm fine with this play. Because Acolyte. So I, I I have one more HP, but it's very annoying. Um... He's at eight. It's my best play, right? I think. So he's down to six, and he loses Aatrox here. So he can't really play one-cost cards anymore. 
I think we're good. I do like this play, but maybe maybe I should have saved the... I don't know. I'm not sure. He can't play these cards anymore. JJ! There it is. Woo! Not bad. Mm. Don't worry. I brought my own Uh. Okay. That's a cool idea. I like that. I like that idea a lot. That's very cool. I can keep this, but nah. So there's a lot of cards that actually buff um, buff your dudes everywhere. That could level her very quickly. I like that idea. Very inventive. I never thought of it. Not ideal. Zelani might be scary late game. For sure. That's not that's not Zelani though. It doesn't matter. I need to start pushing cards. I could I'll have to do it. It is what it is. I drew all my natural acolytes, but no um no good landmarks to pop. This is a scary card on its own though. This card is quite strong. I guess a very strong card. Being a 5-2, and now we can play Preservarium plus this, but I'm still hoping for the one cost landmark. We'll see what happens. Nice card, overall. Yeah, that's the card I was talking about. Specifically, that one card is extremely powerful. The desert by my side. We can block these guys. Always forward. That's a lot of damage. Alright, let's do this. We can play another Acolyte. And now we're actually pushing for close to lethal. Because we're going to 2 HP. Kind of hard to ping off. These guys only have 2 HP anyway. I'll see. I don't know. This bad boy. It's a nice draw, but not for this turn. Wow, that's pretty sick. That's a pretty sick play. Another day, another explosion. It's not worth attacking, I think. To push 5 damage to fate. Uh, actually, it's not worth it. I'm pretty sure it's not worth it. Nice kill to Ziggs, actually. Good for him. But um, he wasted mana for that. So now, now we have Right of Negation plus Right of Arcane. Actually, we, we can't play both. They play one of them. Yeah, we have, we have enough. We should have enough for lethal next turn. Because these guys are temper. As long as I open attack and don't lose these guys, I should win. It's a good draw as well, because I can combo it with this as well. Okay. No cards of that name. Men die, but Sharima lives forever. I don't see how that wins for him. I don't think he's strong enough at the moment. Is that a challenge? He'll have no blockers. This is getting scary. No, it's a uh, three. It's eight damage to face. I'm at, I'm at three HP. I think we're fine. I don't see how he kills us here. We have double right of negation, right? He doesn't have a zero available to burst summon those units. Yeah, I just don't see how we lose. Peace! Woo! 
beautiful. Unless he ran healing, I guess, maybe. Thank you very much, buddy. I appreciate that. Thank you, friend. Wow, first mirror match. That's a good start. For the mirror match, I think this card is the most important card. I think. Maybe I'm wrong. I think it's the most important card in the mirror match. Yeah, it has to be. I mean, it's the, important, it's the most important card in every match. As long as we have this card, we're in a good spot. I'm happy with that. It's much better than this. One drop Chemist is the best. I disagree because this gives me infinite um, Ruinous Acolytes in the top five cards of my deck. So maybe 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 it's good, but I don't think it's as good as this. Getting more Acolytes feels just stronger overall. He can play his own Acolyte. We trade for it. I think we trade for it every time. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think we do. Yeah, because we have more Acolytes than him, so we want to kill them off as early as possible. So now we have Chemist into Ruinous Acolyte. Okay. We never ping that. We, we need to get our engine going as fast as possible. It's a bad card for him. Um, that's a very unfortunate card for him. Now, if we get the landmark, we definitely play it, I would say. Yeah, we play the landmark for sure if we get it. Because his guy is at 2 HP. Ooh, hello. Yeah, let's swing, and then we can play Endless Devout. Because Endless Devout is actually a really solid blocker. And then we can play Ziggs plus Runus Acolyte on it. So you can't really afford not to... Like, yeah, we have a lot of options now. Really bad card for him, unfortunately. And there's a very good chance we get the one drop as well. Beautiful. Literally no tempo from him at all. He has no tempo whatsoever. I guess we just gotta Poke Stick whatever he plays. Let's Poke Stick. It's not it, unfortunately. But um, we actually have a really good explosive minefield here if we want to play it. Another day, another explosion. Yeah, I don't mind this play at all. Play Ziggs. He's had his trash. Oh, I didn't realize he was leveling this guy. We might be in trouble now. I might have misplayed. Uh, let's see what he, let's see what we get. We've got a really good attack here. So, well, now it's definitely this. We just play double uh, Runus Acolyte and just go crazy. Yeah, double Runus Acolyte is insane. Wow, three mana do nothing. That's beautiful. That is absolutely beautiful. We should be good here to win, I think. How's the new expansion? No complaints for me, brother. Wow, he runs a card I don't run. That was that was unexpected. Uh, he runs a card I don't run, bro. I did not expect that card to be a thing. Wait. Oh, when you destroy an ally, that's fine. I guess it's fine. It's a pretty big swing. Stun it? I did stun it. Alright, killing Ziggs is very, very important here. Down to two is a problem for him because now I have now I have Ziggs. So if I draw anything to pop the landmark, I just insta win. And I have this. Wait. Wait, you can't you can't target landmarks with that though, can you? Come on, give me an acolyte! It's not an acolyte. <sighs> Heart, it's painful, chat. It's painful. It's so painful. Bro, why can't I pop my Lundmork? Why can't I pop my Lundmork? What is this? Why can't this pop that? I don't comprehend it. It's the 
best play we have. That does nothing. We just open attack win, right? If I'm not mistaken. I think open attack is win. Zig spell is good. That should be a win, I think so too. Why didn't he ping Ziggs? Um, funny enough, he might ping Ziggs. The play is actually this. Because it's burst P2 damage. Because I can replay Ziggs into that. If he has a ping for Ziggs, we kind of get screwed. So the play is always um, Ziggs again. And then this, if that makes sense, chat. Burst pop landmark, yeah, that's the play, exactly. That's what we needed to have um, this in hand. There it is. That was a close fight. How do you like that, it was very close. Getting his groove? Absolutely. Diamond today? Possibly. At this rate, it's possible. Um, It's fine. Landmark's finally good, Giga Chat. These landmarks are pretty spicy. I need a better landmark to pop this with, though. I'll, I'll see. Oh, 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 oh. Speck of the devil! Look who decided to show up! Our friend! Our friend's like, hey, I got you, brother. Don't even sweat it. Oh, come on, listen. Let me do that! Oh my god, this is gonna be a sick explosive minefield, bro. Yo, this is kind of disgusting. The amount of damage we're gonna do next turn on four? I'm not even kidding, it's, it's kind of insane. So early, GG. My only question is, do I attack? Two mana plus one plus two is kind of sick. It's a perfect counter to this. Whereas I'm gonna have all of these guys at four HP on mana four. I don't know if I attack here or not. I really don't, I'm not sure. I think I think he might be bluffing, like may, I think he has it and he's uh, just hoping, I think he's AFK to push three damage. I think that was what happened there. We'll see what we do, I'm not sure yet. He's AFK, that's what it looks like. He's not bluffing. You never know, chat. Bluffing on turn two, I've seen it happen before. I personally have done it before. Dinner you see, chat? what I tell you? Man. what did I tell you, chat? They always cheat. I'm afraid of single combat here, to an extent. This will prevent every single combat possible. It's just too strong. Quick attack kind of sucks, but whatever. It's fine. Does he ever tumble here? If he tumbles, I'm doing really, really good. Do I have lethal if he tumbles? I'm, a, I'm one off lethal if he tumbles. Kill that vein? No. Yo, Chad, he's bluffing again. The man went for another bluff. He's insane. He's insane! It's a lot of damage. Repentus! He doesn't even get to kill it. That's, that's huge. This thing surviving is actually huge. Opponent snapped. <laughs> yes, he did. Swift death. Imagine I find an acolyte. Let's 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 go crazy here. Imagining. Imagine I top deck an acolyte chat. Imagine how sick that is. He could rally, I guess, but it's whatever. There's no elusives to worry about. How's he ever winning this? He doesn't have Overwhelm. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so broken, bro. It's so broken! You can't! You can't just give me another one! There are some things that in life are illegal, brother. Watch him play Aatrox, thinking maybe that saves him. Bro, I'm so sick of this. I'm so sick of these tumbles, bro. 
I'm, I'm being honest here. I'm so sick of Tumble right now. I'm sick of it! By my hand, I, will end their suffering. I think we can just kill Ziggs. Do we ever... No, we never suicide Ziggs, do we? We sacrifice an Acolyte. We can't keep getting away with it. Let's top deck another, uh... Another one of these. Just to have it. Why did it happen to me? I have made a mistake. <laughs> Lord. Lord, have mercy on me. Oh my Lord, it's unethical. It is so unethical, bro. It's so unethical. He can't even play blockers. He can't even play blockers. No blockers for you, brother. Even zero mana cost blockers are are, are, are forbidden. <laughs> he has no mana for I know he doesn't. I'm aware of that. Yo chat, I just wanna say this is Can we can we believe this is mana six, bro? Mana six, chat! We're swinging for 31. Mana six. Somewhere around there. Yo, Shining, thank you for the two months, brother. Two months supporting the stream. I appreciate that, Shining. Thank you very much. Do we ever keep Rite of Negation since we have Acolyte's Reliquary? Just, I think we do. To negate his big spell. That's, that's like the only way he really comes back into it, right? If we already have a starting Acolyte's Reliquary, I think Rite is actually a good keep. Why do you play Rise when you can play this? Very good question, sir. The answer is I have absolutely no idea, my good friend. I have absolutely no idea. That's a very good draw as well. To the dark within. Shadow and misery. We kill this off as soon as possible. I know it's a weird play, but I think we kill this off as soon as possible because first of all, it will lifesteal. Second of all, he can buff it. No, we don't. Uh, because we have now Endless Devout as well with, uh, on three. Unless we draw another one of those. Oh, bro, 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 stop, stop. It's too much! Stop it! Boom! Yo, what's up, Pyros? Thank you for the three months supporting us, friend. I appreciate that a lot. Oh my god. It's, it's broken. It's broken beyond belief, chat. There is there is no ethicalness to this. There is no ethical assassin in, in this in this entire game. Nope. Denied. <laughs> just got denied. We don't even care. We just deny it immediately. Immediately denied. And now we have endless devout as well dropping down. That does nothing. That does literally nothing, friend. I would love to find just the random acolyte so I can pop this and make him just insta quit. That's what I'm truly. Wait, what? He's buffing it to kill off one of my guys, but I'm just going to block with a 3-3, bro. And I've never seen a man so wrong about a play in his life. I've never seen somebody so wrong about a play. Yeah, buff your attack. Go ahead. That's horrendous. You do realize this is not a win condition. This wants to die. It embraces death. All right, give me the value right now. Right now. That's not a bad card. We'll draw first, though. Oh, my God. Brother man, take me by the hand, take me to the land that I understand. <laughs> meta five, bro. It's, it's, stop it. It's meta five. What are you doing? Pokey time. The worst part is we have pokey stick plus right, man. We have pokey and right of negation. Oh my, this is an everything counter, not an Aatrox counter, an everything counter. We just counter everything, bro. Bro. Okay, that was that was a little bit... Of, can we just talk about how unethical that was? When he summoned as well? Like, no, you... No, 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 no. That is, that is, that is, that is not, that is not okay. That is not okay, sir. 
That is not okay. You can't heal all the way to five, bro. Come on. Come on. Show a little bit of respect. Show a little bit of respect, brother. Please. That's all I ask. A little bit... Bro. Bro, he has everything, chat. He's cheating. He's actually cheating, chat. He's actually cheating. He's a cheater. Oh my god, and he has... Bro, what is this? I'm gonna have to take so much damage to face here. What am I supposed to do? I've lost. Oh my god, he's cheating. He's cheating, chat. What a roller coaster, yeah, I know. I mean, Ziggs is leveled, I guess, for what it's worth, but I don't know what to do. I think that's the play, honestly. It makes it really hard to play blockers properly. I think that's correct. I don't know if it is. I think it is. I think this is correct also. Because he has to play blockers, right? He has to play blockers. You disagree? Wow, that sucks. Does he have more units to play? I don't know. We'll find out soon enough. He's down to 2 HP, which is not that bad. Being up to 2 is not that bad. He can't even assimilate because I have this. Find out the next episode of Dragon Ball. Wrong order. There is no right order, unfortunately. He'll heal no matter what. There is no right order, chat. Atrox is nasty. He is kind of nasty, I agree. Let's hope he assimilates right now. Right now, I want to see an assimilata. Do it. There it is. Wait, what does assimilate even do here? He, he still levels. Assimilate does nothing, actually. Wait, assimilate does nothing, does it? There's no reason to deny this, right? Like, we get nothing from doing it. Okay. Um, we need to play an Acolyte immediately. He's one off lethal at the moment, unless he has a buff. He's winning with a buff, though, unfortunately. Damn it! Chad, help me. Help me, we're losing! We're losing! We scared him, though. We scared him from not playing these because he's afraid. He thinks he needs to heal right away. He's scared, chat. He is scared! He is terrified! No! No, come back, Aatrox! Good. Okay. We might be able to survive. So bald? Yes, he is. No, 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 no! We lost. It's over, chat. We lost. Oh, it was such a close game. It was such a close game. Close game, but still, yeah. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. Healing is cheating? True. I took this deck and made a PNZ printer version that is even crazier. Really? Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Not a horrible hand. Again, you want that one cost landmark, but not horrible. I think I could have won that if I played it a bit better. I made a few misplays. This is one of the most aggressive starts you can get um, on one and two. It's not the best long-term start, but it's pretty dang good aggressive play. Like, there's a lot of damage happening here very early. There's no reason to attack. Because we're only pushing two damage and we're giving, doing him a favor. We already have a chump blocker for this and we have a way to kill it. Home is just around the portal. Do I mind if she hits face? 
Give me a one quest lamar, please. No? Guess not. How do we how do we deal with this? I guess we uh act like this. Yo, thank you, Amaideus, for the four months, sir. Thank you very much. Bro, bro! Stop! It's fine. I just need one more, and I win. I'm, oh, that's a that's an that's maybe the best top deck. This might, I I can't think of many better top decks than this. I can't think of many better top decks than this. It's amazing. It's an amazing top deck. One of the best possible top decks I could add. Because now I get to like all my acolytes get even further buffed. They get even stronger than they are now, and I I just I just fly. I fly me to the moon. And let me sing amongst the stars. Papaya is my real name and... Alright, let me see. What are we doing here? I think we play Ziggs, actually. I think we actually play Ziggs here. Because we can do Scrappy Bomb as well. We'll see what he does before that, but... Ziggs is very strong. I can't I can't express how unethical these plays are becoming. Oh my lord. Wait, one, one. Okay, I don't even need to care about this anymore. It's fine. He's getting rid of his zigs. Bro. Oh! What? Like, how am I so unlucky? I don't comprehend A! This is the only play we have. We gotta stun two of them. This one and this one. They're both getting stunned. Right now. I have no shame. I don't even know what shame is, chat. Bro. That doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter. I don't even care. I'm missing two damage to phase, that's true, but... This is still very, very strong. It's still a very strong attack. He's getting close to leveling Nora as well, unfortunately for us. Now we just need ways to destroy landmarks. That's it. We need ways to destroy landmarks. He's an RNG master, he controls it, I see. That's fine. 10 damage phase, not the 8 HP. Ziggs wins this game very often, in many different ways. As long as I find one way to destroy landmarks, I win the game immediately. IMMEDIATELY we win the game, if we can find a way to destroy landmarks. He can Ruination next turn, we gotta keep that in mind. There is the possibility of Ruination, which we have to be aware of. Never mind, there is no possibility of Ruination. It doesn't exist. Never heard of it. Look at this man, just open attacking. Just saying, hey brother, I have Ruination. Do we care about that? There's a very good chance this deck runs like burst speed, whatever. We'll block it. Never block here, you think? There's, there's, there, there is the never block here play. I, I kind of maybe agree with that, but because I'm giving him board space, right? But at the same time, he's, he's spending all his mana on ruination. I don't really care. Let him ruinate. He's spending all of his mana. Like I'm just gonna open attack win. I don't see how I lose this. Oh, interesting. Preservarian is good. I need I need card draw at this point. It's a bit awkward to get another one of these. Okay. That that is also quite awkward. That's why you don't block. Maybe you're right. You might be right. You might be right. You might be correct. Maybe I shouldn't have blocked. That's a that's a decent draw. It's not amazing, but it's decent. I think I have to open attack. You only like card games, right? Alright, so Nora's dead. And he's dying with these. That's a that's a deny immediately. Whatever that was gonna be. For this. We can't let uh Ziggs die here. Ever. Because we're literally winning by destroying one landmark. One landmark gets destroyed with the game immediately. 
Who here plays lore while on the toilet? That's a good question. Now let's let's end it. I'm fine with dropping empty two immediately. Burst speed, beautiful. That's all we need. What a, what a, what an absolute giga chad, bro. The elements bind the living and the dead. Bro, why are you like this, chat? Type 1 if you want to see the most Giga Chat play of all time. Type 1 if you want to see the most Giga Chat lethal of all time. Here it is. I'm so good at this game, bro. I don't even... And I'm so good at this game, bro. I'm so good at this game. I am so talented! Look at this Giga Chat lethal. Oh yeah! There it is. All right, that was that was fun. Let that sink into his brain. Oh, that's a nice lethal. That is a fun lethal. Woo! All right. Who's my next victim? First good play I've ever seen Grappler make. <laughs> there was more than one though. There was more more than one way to lethal that I think. Was there? No, not ah. Uh... I could have deal 4 damage, then pinged it and killed it, yeah. No, there was more than one way to lethal it, but I think that was a fun way to do it. That was the only one. No, I think you could have done deal 4 and ping to kill his uh, 5 HP lifesteal. That's 6 mana. Then you play Ziggs for 3 more mana. That's 9 mana. And then pop. But yeah, still. Pretty cool. Ziggs. It's a mirror match. Um, I don't mind drop the bomb in this matchup. I think it's a really early dude. It's a, it's a good way to kill it. Now nah, I gotta look for my guys. My, my loss condition is not finding my, my landmark. Decent opener. If he plays the landmark here, we're in a bit of trouble. He doesn't have the landmark, it seems. That's really good. It's really good. I don't have enough mana otherwise. Oh, nice. In that case, it was the best play. In that case, I'm just amazing. Three mana summon two landmarks kind of sucks because I don't want to lose this guy. Oh, this is so good, dude. This is so freaking good. I got to think about that. I'm not sure about that. Do I block? No. He didn't, he didn't break a landmark, unfortunately. Because we're pushing more damage than he is. We just start racing, I think. I think we play Endless Devout here as well and then attack. There's no really good punish for that. He could play, uh... Well, he could play Ziggs, though. Ziggs is a 3-4. Yeah, we just attack. Ziggs punishes that pretty hard. This is a great way to pop that, by the way. Like, this... We actually want this to die, so... It's pretty good. Unleash energy is pretty solid. Oh my god, that's a great top deck. This'll be a blast. <laughs> he doesn't attack here, I'm fine. That's fine with me as well. Kill Ziggs. How? I, I just go wide here, I think. He has no landmark to break anymore with... Um, what's it called? I have a very wide board. And we can play uh, this plus this if we want to. That's pretty sick, though. This is better. It has to be open attack. No, it doesn't because I have Rolling Sands. Rolling Sands make it that it doesn't have to be open attack. He might stun my unit. But he only stuns one of them. It doesn't matter. If I didn't have Rolling Sands, it would might have to be. 
Like that was that was the one literal counterplay, but like it doesn't make a difference. My smoke. It's a greedy block by him. Because I have a uh, Zig's about to level up as well. Which is problematic. Pokey stick on this is decent. But again, it's it's kind of mana lost to an extent. Okay. And we have two really, really big Acolytes on board. Also, we have a uh, insane amounts of landmarks compared to him. And uh, we have Explo Explosive, if we want to use it. Now, he can kill my Ziggs. Just kind of Sag, but whatever. That does nothing. That does something, though. That's, that's decent. I have Unleashed Energy if I want to use it. And I can Burst Prox Sarcophagus. Oh my god, what a good draw. Holy crap. What a good draw. Um, I think I want to stun his Ziggs. Though, I think Ziggs is the most problematic card because he's about to level up, and him leveling Ziggs kind of sucks. Runa's Acolyte on this, and then we have Burst Speed Unleashed Energy on this. I think we're looking solid. Yeah, we're looking great. I don't see what even challengers here. GG, I guess, yeah. It's GG, for sure. What do you challenger? It's fine. You have one less blocker. No problem. Need acolyte support. Yes, sir. And it's insane. It's actually insane. Open attack is GG. I'm aware of that, yes. Because he only has one blocker. What are we waiting for? <laughs> I got a short fuse. You got a short fuse? I, I believe it, brother. Burst stun, yep. Burst stun is pretty sick. How do you like them booms? <laughs> I like it. What is the score chat? <sighs> Evelyn Viego. Uh, drop the bomb is no good, I think. I'm gonna find her one drops. Definitely keep one Aruna Sacolite, though. Nice draw. Nice card. Really good versus this deck as well. Right. We've got a good curve. One drop, two drop, three drop. Pretty standard. That's very good to stop Hate Spike. I wonder if I play Ziggs before anything else. I think I do have to play Ziggs here on curve. I'm pretty sure Ziggs on Kirby is just necessary. It's 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 too much stats not to do. I think. And no matter what blocker he plays, I attack with everything, don't I? Now he does have hate spike for two mana, which is kind of solid. But this is fine. This is, this is absolutely fine. It's a lot of damage to face, and Ziggs is going to start going out of control as well. Challenger doesn't matter too much. Drop the bomb is a nice card. We just stunned that, I think, and we're good. Why is Ziggs just so thick? His mama made him that way. What do you mean? What kind of question is that? It's obvious. I would have more landmarks on board. Interesting tech. Oh yeah, but he's playing Viego. Never mind, it's not a tech. I thought it was an interesting tech for that card. Okay. I'm not mad at that. It's fine, okay. 
interesting choice of card. That was hot. Uh, I want more. That is disgusting. That's actually disgusting, dude. Wow. That is a disgusting top deck, I think. That's an annoying card, I have to admit, though. That is a very annoying card to deal with. But it is what it is. Zig's levels very soon. It's a lot of damage. <laughs> that is a lot of damage, boys! No, don't face palm me, brother. You weren't ready for my deck. Mmm. 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 My tempo is too powerful. Yeah, yes. What are you drinking, water? Every day is water. My first bad opening hand. Like, really, really, really bad. Yeah, it's still bad. Uh, I need to find the one-cost landmark to make this worth anything. <sighs> it's a really bad opening hand. I mean, it could be worse. Like, that helps a little bit, but not much. I, I need the, the one-cost landmark to make this hand actually work, or I'm kind of screwed. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Not that great. Play a two-drop, maybe? Fix my stage first or my lyrics. So much Worthless. To do. I can block and kill her, but whatever. Wanna hear us? Oh, think I got a beat. Let's finish her off. He might heal her. I don't care. Let him spare, spend his healing on her instead. Sorry, Papa. Lyrics just aren't coming. The second to Seraphine. Um, that's two Seraphines, actually. That's not bad at all. I'm not mad at that. Two Seraphines is pretty good for us. We can get lucky in top deck. Um, a kill for her. A Mystic Shot. It's fine. This is why I need that one cost landmark so bad. It just generates me so much value with double Rite of Passage. And I'm not getting it. Bro! Give me my Valu! I'm getting tilted! Give me my value! Bro, if he gets Lifesteal. Chad, if he gets Lifesteal. If he gets lifesteal and first proc... Okay, it's fine. The roam is fine. Come on, give me the one mark! <laughs> Bro. Bro. Bro, what are you doing? Game, what are you doing? Game, what are you doing to me? Bro, my hand sucks! I gotta kill Victor. He's too powerful. He's the only blocker for Fearsome as well, so that's kind of an imp important thing to do. Okay, that's, that's important. Killing that was important. That was, that was an annoying card. You can play all the Poros he wants, I'm just attacking and dealing three to face. Dude, we didn't find the one-cost landmark. That's the only card I need. If I can find that one card, I party. I party like it's, like it's my birthday. Come on, card, where are you at? Show up! <laughs> Bro, I'm gonna lose my mind. I am going to lose my mind. I'm getting tilted. I think I can't afford to waste these two cards yet. Because I have no good landmark to revive. I have no good landmarks to revive. Wait. Where's the fearsome? God, I forgot it doesn't have fearsome. Chat, I forgot. Chat, I forgot they nerfed it. I forgot it was nerfed. In my mind, this had fearsome. I entirely forgot, chat. Bro, what are you doing, Aculite? What are you doing to me? Stop. It was never fearsome, was it not? I don't remember. As long as he burns his mana as well, I have no right of negation either, by the way. If he plays the 10 cost card, I'm screwed. Dude, what's my hand? What the hell is my hand? 
Kill me, please. Oh my god, bro, it's insane. It's so stupid. It's so stupid I have to play scrappy bombs, bro. It's so disgusting that I have to play scrappy bombs. It's so disgusting. Please, just give me the one-cost landmark. Please, just top deck it. Please! Oh my god. <gasps> ah! What is this trash? Five out of nine. Back. I am superior life form. That's fine. I'm not mad. I'm not upset. I am not upset. I am not upset. I am not upset. I feel no fear. He's running low on Seraphinas. This is a fact of life. He will not have enough Seraphines to survive. He's running low on Seraphinas. Seraphina will die. She will be destructoided. I have absolute belief in that. Okay. That's two Seraphinas dead. Play the play the last one. Play the last Seraphina, I dare you. His name is God Draw. It might be true that he's a god at drawing. This is this is actually a possibility. We pass here. Bro, my hand is such trash. Watch me get the one cross number now. Oh my god, bro. Bro! I'm tilted. I'm actually I'm actually I'm actually tilted. I'm actually I'm actually I'm I'm I'm, I'm tiltado. I have it took a while, but I finally got tiltado chat. It, it, Where's my, where's my, where's my value? Where is my value? Where's my value? I gotta kill Billy because first of all, he can't pill cascade like twice to save it. And second of all, he, he doesn't get the gem so he can buff his uh, dudes to block. I have no value. It's actually insane. I have no value. Oh my god. I have to save it. I don't have a choice. I actually don't I have I actually have to save it. I actually have to save it. Stop it. Stop hurting me. Stop! Where's the landmark? Even now, if you give me the landmark, I'm not gonna be too upset. I will be upset, but not too upset. I'm losing my mind! He has blockers for everything! This game, man! It tilts me! Maybe he'll miss block. Maybe he's not. Maybe he's gonna forget the block chat. I drew nothing. I wish I could eat this coffee cup and digest it. Just to detilt a little bit, but I think it's physically impossible to do. I'm considering it though. I'm, I'm thinking of strategies. Maybe if I like... Like if I put it with pineapple in the fridge for like 20 hours and... It, 